Hey guys, what's going on? Tribok here. Today we're going to be playing some Farming Center 2019 on the Ravenport map. We do have cows now, as some of you guys may have seen it on my channel. This is on my channel, the one that I hauled the cows on. So if you guys want to go check that out, there will be a card that popped up up here in the top over here. Just click it and scroll down a little bit and you can see my channel. And then you'll be able to see more FS19 videos of me on my channel and you can see them on here um nick was posting i don't know if he's posting like crazy like i am because yeah i don't know i haven't talked to him in a while so we have our skid steer here we're gonna get it unloaded so basically the agenda of the day is to feed the animals so we're gonna take our skid steer off we're gonna buy a new piece of machinery that actually works as a nice flatbed. So we'll park it right here, I think. We will get back up in the pickup. We'll just leave that bale on, I think. And we'll go fill this trailer up with some hay. Now, I don't think it has like straps or load lock or anything. I'm gonna unstrap this and try to get that bale out. Just cause every time I do this, it zooms in. And that is very annoying. Um, yeah, so we'll head back to the shop quick, and we'll meet the payloader to load it up. Alright, so we are arriving at the shop here. We're going to wheel in, and we're going to buy our new piece of machinery. Now, this is going to allow us to mix, oops, this is going to allow us to mix rations, so you can put all this stuff in it, mix it up, TMR. Basically, I'm pretty sure it's the same as the other. There's the mixer there. We're going to put a bale in and see what it can do. Now, I don't know what's... Well, that's the flag over there. We do have an American flag on the map. It's kind of cool. We have lots of them. These loader controls are a little wacky for some reason. Alright, how much did that fill it up? I wish we had the percentages, because then you know how much of stuff to put in. I don't see the percentages anyway. It's just either you got it or you don't. So I can knock that one in, okay. Now we'll finish loading the rest of the silage bales on the flatbed. Actually, I think we'll load straw, and then we'll load hay, and then we'll see. Put two straws in. We'll just spear the straw like that. Knock it down, we'll spear the hay like that. Whatever works. And the steering is tricky. Can't wait till I get my steering wheel set up so that I can run the steering a lot better. Hopefully, a lot better. So we will dump the straw and the grass in. And the grass fell over. Great. There's the straw. Looks kind of full, actually. Oh, yeah. Come back up here, we'll drop this off. There we go. We will spear that bale there. Crap, can't lift high enough. And now I can't get it because this thing's on there. There we go. There we go. Alright, so now that should be full. And start that up. And we're gonna go ahead and take this down there quick. Because it is basically fully loaded. Uh, I believe the rations are basically the same. Looks like it is fairly the same. You still got this little arm on the front. You can scoop stuff up with. And you have your weights there. Looks like those gauges do work. One's your RPM. The other one's how full it is, I believe. I have 1600 
kilograms on here. So we're going to take this back to the farm real fast. Alright, so we're rolling in here. And one thing to notice is that when I turn side to side, the player moves in the cab. Just got it stuck. Hold on. Oh, and when you get it stuck, it just spins like crazy. Instead of, I guess, the other one that did that. But yeah, the player also puts his foot on the pedals. That is one cool thing also to add into that. Um, we'll unload the right side. Unload TMR. So now we should be able to go in here and see the pin information as it's filling up. 6,000, 7,000. Looks like you have to have a lot for those cows. However, we will get these rates up and all that. Clean this, we need water and straw. For conditions, water and straw. Obviously they need water. Straw, I'm guessing you'll need it in the winter. They'll probably format it in there like that. Food, obviously you're saying hay, silage, and grass. So we will go get a load of grass. So I think this is hay anyway, isn't it? Hay and silage, okay, we need to put silage in. I can't believe they don't have like a flatbed to haul this stuff. Like there's not really any, and this isn't really a flatbed necessarily. It's kind of like a, I don't know, it's not a flatbed. It's a cotton thing in the jig. Whatever you want to call it, cotton flatbed. I think I want to spear one side on the edge, spear one over here, swing it, lift it up, I want to spear two over here, or more than two, that's fine, okay, gosh dang it, they all fell out down now, there we can, spear two now. Yeah, I'm not going to stack these because it's a pain to do it. I'm too used to 17 when everything's slow. And the loader jumps back to the center right away. That is fine. We can take this down. We'll take the pickup. I'm guessing these bales are going to go flying everywhere and fly off. We will see. They kind of do have a little edge to them, so if it does start sliding, I don't think they will fly off, but we'll try it. So, we'll take this down to the cow farm, and then I'm going to take the payloader down also, and we will see you guys when I get there. Okay, so we wheeling in here. We did lose all but two. And we got to get a straw bale for this loader. There we go. Now I'm going to take this home, I'm going to buy a straw bale, let's go here, go to, wait no, this one, pallets, no, gosh dang it, there, bales, we got to buy a straw bale, and you can just buy one if you want, which is very nice, so hopefully we can stick it between these two, I don't know if we will or not. Oh yeah, we can. It's pretty crazy that the square bales are bigger than the round bales. I don't necessarily know how that works and all. But uh, yeah, the bales in this game are always have been really small. Unless you get a baler that's got bigger bales. So I'm going to wheel this home now. And we will put the straw in the thing. And get our cows to start producing some milk. Okay, so we're wheeling in here. Just getting here. Um, we'll drop these bales off. We'll drop the round one off up here if we can. I don't know if we 
go to just get the round one. There we go. We can put this one in the feeder. I think we can. So you might actually have to have the blower this year to put straw in. Okay, so you can't really do it that way. Um, we'll put it in the mixer and see if we can do it that way. Oh boy. Man, these controls are strange. Very, very strange. go now I'll stick the round bale in the um, skid steer no clue how this works tip side straw blower so this is a straw blower tip side unload oh so you can unload it if you want the blower or you can just unload Whip this under here. Should go spike it off in the machine. Oh, there we go. Doesn't really sit in there great. I don't think. Kind of weird. And then load this side, or is that something different? Side on load. What? I would have thought this would be the unload side. What would make the most sense is to unload it that way. Hey, salad straw. There's nothing in there. For 10 days capacity. So that's nice. I give you 10 days. Or oh, maybe it's over. No, this is water, I'm guessing, over here. Or you might not need to give them any straw. No. I guess we'll just do it like that. So you can shred it like that, looks like. Which is kind of neat, actually. So they have that set up. Or you can blow it out like this. And blow straw out like such. I guess it doesn't really matter which way you do it. Come on, stop unloading. Switch it. I kind of like it this way. And it just dumps it out. Let's put it on one monitor, two monitor. Oh boy, works pretty good right there. And then obviously, if you want to ditch the bale, you just do this, like that, and the bale's gone. So there's that. Um, yeah, I don't know why I can't put, hey, let's try silage, we'll throw a silage bale in quick. And then, so there's the milk full point, whenever we get some milk, we can haul it. Basically it's just like, hauling water the animals, only, instead of getting it somewhere, you have to get it from here. Like I said, Monday, we will be starting a all new series on hopefully a modded map but I don't think there will be and or we will wait till a modded map's out like I said I don't know how long it'll be till one's out so you can't really put bales in here anymore like that so I'm gonna jump in the mixer we will back up there and see if we can't unload this straw okay Okay, so we can't do that. Let's go ahead and unload it. 
Boy, that's a lot of straw. A lot of straw there. Let's get in this so it'll quit beeping on us. And of course, loading at weird angles. There it goes. Jumping this, back it up here. Side that unload on right. Where'd that bell go? Oh, must have went in. Yep, it went in. Alright. And then we do have a grass bill out in the middle of that field, I suppose. I suppose we can get that. Grab that real quick. I'm gonna try something with the straw first. Oh, I can't scoop up the straw? Oh. Ooh, the scooping. Look at the level that is now. So it's kind of like, it's, I don't know. Weird. It's, well, as you guys can see, it's similar to 17. Oh, no, I don't want to dump it on the ground. I want to dump it feeder. Well, shoot. Oh, that's real nice, actually. Yeah. Anyway, we'll finish scooping this up here. Nope, scoop it up. We'll just dump it right here. There's one on it. We'll get this grass bale out here. After we climb this hill, there's a ditch right there. You can see the seat flying around. Put this down. We'll grab that grass bale, feed it to the animals, and we'll be all done for really the animal part. We might, we'll probably start on doing, I don't know, probably do some sheep, pigs, horses dogs we'll do all that once we get the animals covered hopefully it'll be Monday so then we can start our farming series we'll throw this in real fast I don't know if we'll be able to last time it was up here and we like just dropped it off and it fell in so I guess you have to actually drop it off into the feeder it doesn't just disappear all right so those guys are good I am probably I don't know, we'll see how it goes. I might speed up time, we'll see. And we might just sell them. Just just because you guys saw how we did it. We saw the process and all that. Uh, actually, what I could do is throw together a long video on how to do it. Maybe I'll do that for later on. We'll see. But anyway, if you guys want to go see the next episode of Farming Simulator... There will be one on my channel coming out really short, or if it's it's probably already out by now, because I'm going to post at the same time. But anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, hit the like button, and we will see you in the next FS19 video.